course, there's no escape in what's happened in the United States. Republicans have been inbreeding with the lunatic fringe in their party for so long, they finally sired something that should have been kept in the attic. <laughs> huh? The GOP spent the last 30 years poking that gorilla in the cage called the silent majority, and when they finally picked the lock, out marched Donald J. Trump. A ranting, racist, fork-tongued, misogynist, fire-breathing, billionaire, bully, bullshitter from the television set. Because the GOP's become a party where hate drives debate and billionaire brutes pied pipe the white middle-aged seething masses into states of delirium, promising to rain down biblical retribution on whatever other besides themselves they can find to blame on America's woes. All the while cherry-picking quotes from Leviticus to justify their homophobic, mexican bait and muslim hate and gun love and bigotry and anger as they defiantly march backwards to the foggy mists of time to the wrong side of history, looking to make America great again. Whatever the hell that was. The Donald is America's bare-naked id run amuck. He said women who get abortion should be punished. Beg to differ, bucko. The only woman who should be punished is Donald's mother for not having one. <laughs> <laughs>